How's it going, ladies and Bruce? It's our puppy six killer, and welcome to a new series we're going to be doing. Well, yeah, it's kind of a series. Uh, what I felt like was I wasn't doing enough of the little one-off videos like I used to do on the channel as much. We haven't been doing as many itch.io things like the weekly scratch series or uh, demos for upcoming games and that sort of thing. And I am a huge fan of uh, Yahtzee Crochet, as all of you are probably aware at this point. At least you subscribers are. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to play through all of the Dev Diary games that are out so far. I believe there are nine so far, so we're way behind. There are three still to come, so I'm going to play through all of them in a row. From first release to most recently released, which I believe was Hold the Phone at this point. Um, until they're all done and we've got a bunch of other itch.io stuff I've downloaded for us to have a look at as well. So without further ado, this is Pre-Flight Panic. These are probably going to be short episodes. Bear that in mind, not our usual half hour fare. This is going to be a lot shorter. Ooh, I have already played this. I did play this yonks ago when the game first came out. Um, but I didn't... <laughs> it's been so long I don't even remember how to play. We'll figure it out. Make sure each passenger has their seatbelt fastened before takeoff. Use left and right to select passengers and enter to correct. Yeah, this game came out in early 2019, I believe. Watch for movement. The transgressive lifestyle of the unbelted ones caused them to constantly fidget with shame. Excellent. Okay, so... You. You. You and you. No? Are we good? Jeez, I don't think we're good. Are we okay? I'm worried. Shit. I wasn't ready. I wasn't ready. I wasn't ready. And also my volume's too high. Ow, my ears. Okay. I'm ready. Okay, so shifty guy there. Shifty guy here. Shift. Shift. No, not you. Shifty guy there. Shifty guy there. Shifty guy there. Are we good? Oh, I don't know. I don't like that. Oh god. That's stressful, man. It's so loud. Alright, here we go. If you're confident that you have corrected all wrongdoers, you may enter the galley before the timer ends and signal an early takeoff. Oh, fuck at that, man. Captain Shifty over here. Dude, why are so many of you Shifty? Yours. Hey, we got a star. All right, here we go again. This is terrifying. Attempting to correct an innocent passenger will delay you, as you will be humbled into a brief state of confusion. It hurts my feelings. More than anything. Do one last check. There's a lot of dudes on this plane. Oh god. I didn't get a star though. You must have identified correct passages occupied by mobile devices, of course. Watch for a lack of movement. The afflicted ones always stare downwards, hypnotized by their corruption. Okay. Like this guy. Am I not worried about seatbelts this time? Just phone guys. 
Just phone, guys. Please don't crash while I'm taking coffee. Yes. Level five. Now we got seatbelts as well or something? Maybe? Phones are a lot easier than seatbelts. We good? I missed one. Now we good? No, I saw one! I saw one as we were about to take off! Oh my god! <laughs> Why does that have to be so horrifying? Not you, this one. Systematic. Systematic elimination of the corruptors. Bad man. Everyone get off my plane. That's it. Calling it. I actually think I pooped my pants that time. What am I doing wrong? Answer me that. Maybe there is seatbelts now as well. Facey no movie. Everyone's here's face moves. Everyone. Asshole. <laughs> God, I can't even get past level five. <laughs> now you'll face a blend of sh seatbelt shirkers and device whores. Good. Just what I wanted. Maybe I'll be better at that. Who knows? Probably not. I just missed out on the star that time, unless, you know, we die. I swear to god, I've crashed more planes than I've saved at this point. I've crashed a lot more planes than I've saved. You, shaky guy. Captain shakes a lot. Take your frickin' ADD medication, right now. Before the plane takes off, and you get us all killed. Are we good? Everyone's looking around, no one's wiggling. I just want to get through the levels. Screw the stars, I just want to get through the levels. <laughs> Do the stars if we can get through the levels. Seven. Note that it is possible for one passenger to commit multiple infractions requiring multiple corrections. What an asshole! Anyone that does that needs a slap. You need a slap. They need to get thrown off the plane extra hard. If they're that much of a twat. So I'm not even going to go early, I'm just going to make sure that everything is good. I'm just going to hang out, we're going to check everybody that we can. While there's still time. It looks good. It looks alright. I hope that's alright, that looks alright. Why are my planes pink? Oh god. I turned the headphones down, but I'm sure you enjoy my misery. Um, <laughs> that's not nice. Our, that's not nice. Our planes have now had to call, had call buttons installed, which, with which passengers will summon you if they feel tempted to sin. Correct them as normal to ensure they remain upon the righteous path. 
Are you serious? This row seems good. This row is full of that guy. That row is alright now. This row looks good. What? This row's got this guy in it. This row's got this guy, who's got both infractions. Kick him out of the plane, the wanker. No! Crap, we're out of time! Was that good? Are we okay? Please tell me we're okay. I can't handle another one. My heart can't take it. Oh, thank God. <laughs> Oh, thank God. Alright, here we go. Nine. Okay, this is just another one of those ones. There's no other... You did both again? Get off my plane, bitch. This is no plane for you. Okay, the call button worries me. No. Go away. Stop being tempted to sin. I hate it. Oh my god, how much time have we got? You! What? I mean, sorry, what? Good customer service, that's what it's all about. you game. Nearly spilled coffee all over myself. <laughs> Not you, this guy. I keep clicking on the wrong dude. I'll get to you, alright? Asshole. I'm trying to be systematic, but you're... You jumping out like that is ruining my systematic... Plan. This guy! Look at this guy! What are you up to? No! This one! Come on. Come on. Jesus Christ, this is too stressful, man. This is like having a real job. I hate it. <laughs> Some passengers on this flight have lowered their backrests. Make these malcontents face destiny with proper posture. They'll face death. The slouch of the backrest fiend will make them appear all but devoid of neck. Oh my god, that's too many things. No, piss off. Why can I see this guy's seatbelt but not this guy? Oh, because this guy's got a backrest down. Jesus Christ, are we okay? You can sick of that noise. Getting well sick of that noise, tell ya. Okay, so it makes the seatbelt stick out. Done. Fuck off. Had enough of you. Yes! I'm gonna get out of there before they start exclamation marking and making it worse. Bastards. Alright, here we go. We're just dealing with seatbelt dudes, right? At the moment? Not you. This one. Hey! You weren't like that a minute ago. You changed your mind. You want to be an asshole now. Not on my plane, bitch. I swear to God.
I hope you all die in a car, in a horrible plane crash. What that I'm on. Put me out of my fucking misery. <laughs> To fires of belt and abuses of backrest together are your twin-headed serpent of your nemesis. <laughs> the twin-headed serpent of your nemesis. Really? I still think that the seatbelt guys are the hardest spot, in my opinion. But I am an idiot, so that doesn't help. Are we good? I think we're good. So when they throw phones in as well, we're fucked. Well and truly. Buggered sideways. Backrest users and device slaves tilt in opposite directions, but are equally far from grace. Well, this guy's both. So he doesn't tilt opposite ways, he tilts the same fucking way. <laughs> Not this guy. My god, I just checked him and then all of a sudden he's down for some committing some dirty crimes. Dirty crimes, I say. Dude. Can't you see I'm working down this end of the plane at the minute? No, go, go away. Wrong one. I'm running out of time. For the love of God! <laughs> <laughs> My God, I'm glad I'm not an air hostess. Or whatever it's called. What is the PC term for that now? Air... person. I don't think it matters. Now all three forms of deviant will manifest as humanity drifts ever further from the light of God. <laughs> what horrible monstrosities have you wrought upon us? <laughs> Sorry. No! Go away. I see you shaking there, shithead. No. I didn't want to jump out early before, but now I feel like I have to to stop them uh, talking about other problems. Or making new problems, where there was none before. This is vastly in increasing my blood pressure. <laughs> my blood pressure is going through the roof. All of the passengers' red eyes sit furthest from the light. Have compassion. For they live in the hells of their own making. Answer their calls promptly, for they will become a force for disruption in your work. Oh god. Good, something to be excited about. Okay, he hasn't actually got a problem yet. They just uh, complain more often, I guess? These people should not be allowed to fly. Why are these people allowed on a plane? Look at them! They're idiots! These are monstrous human beings. We should let the plane crash. It'll erase this horrible subset of humanity. Are we good? I think we're okay. But I've said that before. I can't tell. I think we're okay. I keep ruining my autofocus. We're not okay. It's not okay. One passenger backseat down, two headed device? Fuck! <laughs> I feel like we're going to be at this, in this level for some time.
Okay. This asshole. Look out for guys with devices. I can't really tell them very well. Seatbelt guy. Crazy guy. Oh my god, are we okay? I couldn't see anything, but that doesn't mean shit at this point. We're getting close to the end. It's only gonna get worse. We can do this though, I know we can. I believe in us. We're a super smarts. I don't know why I clicked on you. It's you I wanted. Oh my god, there's so many. Stop! What the shit was that? Holy crap, that was terrifying. I don't, I'm not sure I've actually been more scared by a video game in my life. I didn't know this was meant to be a horror game. But it's certainly putting the shits up me, I tell you that much. Shut up! For fuck's sake, stop! You aren't got your seatbelt on! That's not even English, that's how stressed I am right now! You don't either! You sack of shit! I can't do it anymore! <laughs> I'm looking forward to the next game. <laughs> the next game will be good. Please don't throw any more mechanics in. I don't think I can cope. Honestly, I don't think I can cope. The scary one's doing something. Don't start yelling! For the love of God, don't start yelling, it scares me. There's too many! You are all monstrous human beings. I hate every single one of you equally. Except the red eyes one, which I hate. Slightly less, actually, because at least when he's got a problem, you fucking know about it. <laughs> he makes sure you know exactly how upset he is about everything. Of course, because it's always the devices. It's so hard to tell. At this point I might as well just check everyone, because it's... Everyone is such a monstrous anus now that it's... Literally everyone needs correcting. See, that guy was a double anus. Keep an eye out for phones. I'm not good at spotting them. I'm like, I'm really bad at spotting them. I can't see one. Okay. Three levels left. You know I said this is going to be a short episode? I'll probably trim it down. To be completely fair, I will probably trim it down. 
because it's just a whole lot of failure. Although I'm sure you're entertained by the failure. I know I'm entertained by the failure when other people fail. Less fun when I fail myself. <laughs> Though I do specialize in failure. This guy. Seriously, I must have checked everyone, right? Why didn't you tell me about the guy sitting in front of you who's fucking wiggling and shit? Ah! Holy crap, that slows you down so much. I can't do it. I literally can't do this. This is too much now. Even at the best of times, I can barely do it. And this is certainly anything but the best of fucking times. Oh my god, stop wriggling! Okay, the screaming goes worse than I thought because he doesn't just scream. He also slows you down tremendously. I'm out of time? Dude, I've only checked half of them! I only checked half of them. How the fuck did we get out of that one? Who knows? I guess it was less devices. That guy didn't move, so I thought he had devices. So I have to go to these guys, so I might as well just work around them. Not that one, this one, and this one. Literally every other person on that row except that one. Fine. And also not seat belted. Literally, if these were the actual people in airplanes, and airplanes immediately crashed if you weren't seat belted, if, if one person wasn't seat belted, we would never have had a successful airplane flight yet. I don't know, man. And I like it. Every time I think I've fucked it up, we get out. Alright, here we go. Level 20, last one. This is the ridiculously increase my blood pressure simulator. Jeez, I didn't see that. There's two of them as well. I can't even see. Not that one. No. No. Oh my god, these guys just go off every two seconds! Not that one. No, fuck off. You're the worst. No. This guy's on his phone. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. It'd have been too good to be true, wouldn't it? How many people on devices? One unbelted, two with their batteries down, and one on a device. Really? I missed four people?
three people all in that same row, not wearing their seatbelt. Halfwits. They all want to die because they deserve to, I guess. <laughs> That's harsh. Probably true, though. Please, dear Christ, let it end. Stop shuffling. Fine. Put it away, asshole. And your, and your phone as well. Put your knob away and put your phone away. Who the fuck do you think you are, Pee Wee Herman? I don't know, man. I always say that. But I don't know. Thank God. You promise I'm gonna heaven? Jesus Christ. All right, well, we did all the levels. We did all the levels, and that is good enough for me. Because <laughs> being mediocre is my specialty. Um, we did get two stars. That's something. We're going to wrap this one up here. Um, we got a lot more uh, of these games to get to. I will trim this one down. It took about 40 minutes to get all the way through, but there was a lot of failure up in there. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging out with me, and I'll see you in the next one.